was a very long time ago since I did a vlog. I'm so sorry. I know I promised you guys at least one vlog per month, but that, that was um, many months ago. I know I suck. I'm eating. I just woke up. I'm gonna have my breakfast, my tea. I'm gonna watch YouTube. And um, I feel like it would be fun to just hang out a little bit today and talk and show you guys around. Nothing has really changed, but uh, for those of you that wanna see, here you go. Oh, and also, by the way, my hair. What do we think? What do we think? I'm finally red again. Yeah. It did turn out a little bit too dark. I was going for more of a coppery orange look, but it's bright red. But I still love it. <laughs> I have it on my Instagram reel. Yeah, I have an Instagram reel when I dye it, if you guys want to see it. Tebo is the most excited when i get packages but yeah i was just in the shower but i got a delivery a pr from the body shop this is their big i think it's their biggest um advent calendar let's see if i can open it up can you help out tebo oh there we go there we go Okay, so apparently the blue calendar is the smallest, then we have the red one, which is the medium, and then this one, the green, the biggest one. So I'll have a post on that next week for you guys on Instagram, I feel, think. Then, something that I'm so excited about, I got their new uh, Edelweiss, Edelweiss collection. Kinda. Okay, so let's see what we have here. <clears throat> I've been alone the entire morning, so I haven't really spoken to anyone, and therefore my voice is just cracking up. But yeah, this is the Edelweiss collection series that used to be called Drops of Youth. But we have every here, for example. Oh, I didn't get the spray, did I? Oh no, maybe they don't have the spray anymore. So this is the old one, this is the liquid peel, and this is the new one. Then for their like hero product, we have the concentrate. Concentrate? Concentrate. And this I am almost completely out of. I got this in my last last year's advent calendar. So perfect that I have a new one. And then we have the Drops of Youth, youth Cream. And that is now uh, this cream, but this is the intense one. So they have a normal one and then they have a intense one. I'll have to look it up, but I feel like then they don't have the jelly mist and they don't have the essence lotion anymore. But the new things that I want to try out right now is the eye serum concentrate and the eye cream. I'm just fresh out of the shower, so I'm gonna... Try it out. I've already heard great things about it from my friend Ida, so I'm excited. I've showered, I've done my skin prep, and now I'm going to do my makeup, I think. And we're gonna take some photos for a collaboration. So we are now in my studio, and I don't know if you guys can see a difference, but it's super clean. It's just airy in here right now, and it usually is not. Yesterday, by the way, I got Anastasia's new Rose Metals palette that I did use yesterday, but maybe I should use it today as well. Here we have my makeup that I usually use. So this is the Milk Flex Foundation in Cream. It's one of my absolute favorites. And this is my new favorite foundation brush. It's from Flare and it's called Flat Angled Foundation Brush. I usually just go in with a little bit like this and then paint it on. So there we have one side done. As you guys can see, it just covers so 
Well, it just looks like skin, but flawless. Now I'm gonna go in with some of NYX Bear With Me concealer. It is really pretty and lightweight. And this, I just go in with that. Uh, I want to use one of the new About Face blushes. These are my favorite thing ever. If you guys haven't seen that main video, uh, I think I'm going to upload it today. So it will be out when you guys see this. These are just a couple of them and they are so pretty. If you guys like cream blushes, you will absolutely adore these. They are so, so so pretty. Now let's blend in the contour. There we go. By the way, I wanted to quickly talk about one of my latest main videos that I did where I tried tattooing. <laughs> um, I completely understand that people that are uh, professional tattoo artists get annoyed <laughs> when seeing um, me being very unprofessional, uh, unhygienic. I totally, by the way, I'm using the uh, shade Ronchi. It's so, so, so pretty now with my hair. This is not the same, but I can get kind of like irritated-ish when I see someone like use the same mascara on three people for example like a makeup artist doing that cringy when i see people use the same lipstick straight out of the bottle on multiple people you know stuff like that or now when i've really been learning nails i can really get <laughs> annoyed when i see people like i don't know put gel on their skin for example because i know that that can really cause some real big issues uh it can create diseases that you get for the rest of your life it can get really really bad for tattooing this is obviously even worse because it's needles it's blood so i just wanted to let you guys know i will probably talk about this just quickly in a main video as well because i don't think that everyone that watches my main videos, watches my vlogs, but if you are one of those people that were like, you're so fucking stupid, <laughs> I totally understand why you think that. And uh, I will not do any more videos like that. Sorry to those of you that really, really liked it, but I will be doing videos <laughs> while tattooing if and when, when and if I get good at it. So I won't show anything online until I feel like I am as professional as one can be. I'm just gonna put some on my nails as well. Just a tiny, tiny bit underneath my eyes. I also love to powder underneath my bangs because that way my bangs don't get as oily i use a lot here <laughs> um i'm gonna line my lips with the clueless tie lip liner that i still love the color of this is one of my absolute favorites and now for the rose metals palette from anastasia I am gonna go in with the main one. It's going to be Nova, the one on the side right here. But first, Jonas is probably on his way home, so I'm gonna go out with Thibaut and meet him. Um, I am back home and I'm wearing my super cute fleece that I am now wearing 24 seven. So I'm just gonna go ahead and use this Nova color and with my finger, apply it on the lid. Look how pretty that is. Oh, as you saw, I have been using Ashes, the um, cool toned brown, just in my crease. And then I think I'm gonna darken it out with Noble. I'm gonna go in with Noble here in the inner corner as well. 
tint a little bit underneath and then i think i'm gonna go in with heavenly this color just a little bit on the middle and in the inner so there we have the eyeshadow done and in my waterline i'm gonna go in with the about face call me crazy and now for some mascara and i might add a lash in the outer corner hey yo i am back a few days uh, later i totally forgot to continue to vlog and now i'm eating a vegan kit kat drinking my tea watching brad mondo and I'm trying to get some energy. I want to show you guys what I just got in the mail. Um, also, it's quite late. It's like 5 o'clock, I think. Um, and I've been out um, helping my friend Felicia film a video. I helped her film this uh, collaboration video today. She did like a vlog. Um, and we went to the sci-fi bookstore here in Stockholm. And she wanted to buy herself some Harry Potter stuff uh, as that was the collaboration. And somehow she just like forced herself to buy me something just because I had helped her out. I hate when people buy me stuff. I don't know. I feel uncomfortable. So this is the um, science fiction book candle bookstore in uh, Gamla Stan, Old Town here in Stockholm. Um, and she knows that i love that note so um she kind of picked out this black edition like collection book like look how cool this is this i'm obsessed like thank you felicia i don't know if you guys know but i do have a few mangas uh, mostly the ones that i got when i was younger but honestly i would absolutely love to have all of my favorite mangas at least like the first 10 books or something i think that would be really really cool uh, standing on a bookshelf or something when i got it home though i did see that this is the volume three and four so i might have to go back myself and buy number one and two and uh, you guys know how much i love death notes then though, I um, was like just walking through the um, sales section and I was like, if you really want to buy me something, can't you just buy something that is on sale? And I just pointed to <laughs> this Demon Slayer like cutlery <laughs> thingy. So it contains a chopsticks, a little spoon and a little fork. How freaking cute is that? Like really cute, but also just something that I I'm not gonna use that much. I don't even know how much this was. I really really hope that this wasn't that much. Ouch! I don't know if you can see, but I've hurt myself. Me. It's so this I bought um, like a month ago or something. Well, first of all, it was quite expensive because it's a smaller brand. And also as it is from the UK, I had to uh, pay customs quite a lot. But I think it's worth it. I have some other stuff from this brand and the skirt that I have, I literally use at least once a week. Like I love it so, so much. So, the brand is Love Too True, and I bought them the same day that they launched this set because they were just so freaking cute. I couldn't have picked. Hey, hello. Ah, I They're the same, but there's two different uh, colors. So, first of all, we have the gray set. This is a blazer, a cropped blazer, together with the skirt. Oh, it's gonna look so cute. Uh, and this is in a size UK 6, which is usually not my size. I'm usually a size 8, but I saw that my other skirt was a size 6, so I 
really really hope it's not too small and then for the color that i fell in love with i've had uh, other things from them in this exact color. I've had uh, trousers and I've had like a top, I think. But this is very share from Clueless. And if you guys didn't see that on my main channel, I did a review of the collection with uh, Revolution. It would be so cool if I had this then, but now I have it and I really hope it suits me. Just look at this with my hair. So cute. And together with the blazer, the blazer is also a size six. Weird, aren't they? Okay, so should we should we try it on? So let's see. Oh no, is it a little bit too? It's perfect. Yay! Just look at that. That is so cute. Okay, so let's put on the blazer now. How cute! Can you like close this? No, you can't. Okay. Oh well. <gasps> this is adorable. Let's gonna see what Jonas thinks. Wow. He liked it. How cute, right? Oh, and it looks so cute with my hair as well. By the way, did I say in the last clip? That you saw in the beginning of this vlog my hair was a little bit more red so i really wanted it to be a little bit more orange so i added cosmic sunshine from arctic fox the yellow one uh just over top and it made this so now let's try out the gray one so we have the gray one Just think of this with like a, um, a shirt and a little tie. <gasps> Maybe that I even like this more. I think it just looks so cool with my hair as well. Now I'm going to make some tacos, Swedish tacos. So don't come at me. This is how we eat it. <laughs> Hey, Poppel. You know, so we'll have. Boop. We'll have Mida. We'll have Mida. We'll have Die. Yeah. Here is Tebow's dinner. Yum. Something that I just bought for Tebow. This is anti plaque, so for his teeth, uh, once per day. As Tivo is a half Pomeranian, uh, he's very prone to have bad teeth. So I just want to make sure I take care of them as best possible. Pass it good. I mean, he eats it at least. Yeah, he seems to like it. Tivo loves. Um, salad. All right, so there we go. We have our chicken with some spices on it. We have our two, some soft tortillas, and we have these taco tubs. And then we have all of the vegetables. I usually don't have spinach in it, but I just have it, and I don't want to. I don't want it to go bad. Some cheese and stuff. And ignore this, please. But yeah. So now let's eat.
is the end of the day. I'm going to take a quick shower and then we're gonna watch the latest episode of Game of Thrones, House of the Dragon. Let me know what you think of the House of the Dragon, by the way. I'm not, I'm not as into it as I was in Game of Thrones. Obviously, it's for sure not as good, but uh, it's growing on me. I really hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog. It might not have been that interesting. I don't know. I always say that. Fuck, I need to stop. Okay, that's it for me. Have a great day and uh, peace.